Hey, this is Pastor Jay Lee wishing you a happy new year from the Daily Sabbath podcast. The Haggai series, part two. Haggai chapter one, verses 12 through 13. And the whole remnant of the people obeyed the voice of the Lord their God and the message of the prophet Haggai, because the Lord their God had sent him. And the people feared the Lord. Then Haggai, the Lord's messenger, gave this message of the Lord to the people. I am with you, declares the Lord. How do you respond when God confronts you? Israel had let over 15 years pass without making any progress on rebuilding the temple. So God confronts his people with a message through the prophet Haggai. And he said, These people are too consumed with building their own kingdoms to care about building mine. Note that God addressed them as these people. Not my people, these people. Ouch. It was a wake-up call from heaven. But in a pleasant surprise, it says that the people actually obeyed the voice of the Lord. And I love what God says next. He says, I am with you. How quickly the Lord's countenance changes from these people to I am with you. At even the slightest hint of repentance in the heart of his people. Even after they neglected him for 15 years. It reminds me of times when my daughter is being rebellious and does things that really upset me. But I have to admit that as soon as she says, I'm sorry, Dad, my heart instantly melts and I can't stay mad at her. God is like that, but actually more so. See, he loves us enough to speak hard truth to us and give us a wake-up call when we need it. But know that his heart is inclined towards grace and mercy. And he is always ready to receive us back again to himself at even the slightest indication of repentance in our hearts, even if it's been a long time. And so your reflection for today is this. I don't know who needs to hear this today. But perhaps you have been focusing on yourself and your own ambitions and found that you're no happier now than when you started. Maybe it's been years since you gave any real attention to your relationship with God and you wonder if maybe you've waited too long. Know that while the Lord may call you out and give you a wake-up call, His heart is always inclined towards grace and mercy when we turn to him in repentance. And so please, come back home to him. The closing song for this episode, In the Shadow, is by Marion Philosilda. For more music from Marion Philosilda, you'll find a link in the episode description. If you're enjoying the podcast and you would like to support us, you can leave us a rating and review at Apple Podcasts or Spotify, or you can buy Pastor Jay a cup of coffee. If you would like to contact Pastor Jay, visit dailysabbath.com or our Instagram at dailysabbath. When the seasons of life, change, I remember you're still the same. The Father Safety of your embrace
Can